Inertia is a property of matter. Bill, 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 Bill,
And maybe a little flat. Hmm. Now the momentum of the individual pieces is equal to the momentum of the bouncing ball. The explosion doesn't make any difference. That's what we call the conservation of momentum. And now, more great moments in momentum. Momentum. This has been more great moments in momentum. <laughs> Slip box derby is a car without any motors or anything, just gravity momentum and aerodynamics also has a big part to do with it. How does this come down? Just like that? Just straight down. Hold on, can I check my big now? There he goes, David. Well, you go down the hill and it goes really fast. You don't have an engine and you brake when you get past the white line. When you get to the bottom of the hill, the cars have a lot of momentum. The more momentum, the better. How can rockets zoom through space Go for it. where there's nothing to push against? Well, consider the, the following. Rockets move because of the momentum of their fuel. Now, here I have a rocket in my pocket. It's the plastic rocket of science. And for fuel, we'll use just air. One, two, Put it three, in with four, this five, six, small seven, air pump. Nine, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 20 pumps. Nine, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, three, two, one. Two, one. Not, not very impressive. No. So we'll do it again with a little heavier fuel. Here's the same type of rocket with a little water in it. See? Now the water is heavier than air. One. So when it goes three, out the four, back, five, six, it'll have eight, eight, more nine, momentum. 10, 11, 12, and that should make the 13, rocket 14, go higher. 16, 17, 18, 19, About 20, 20, 20, 21, 22, 3, 22, 3, 24. 24. <laughs> See, not bad. Now, as long as the fuel's going this way, the rocket will go this way. And the momentum of the fuel going out the back very fast equals the momentum of the rocket going off the other way not so fast. Now, the rocket doesn't have to be going straight up. No, it works in any direction. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, Basketball's momentum is transferred to the tennis ball, which makes the tennis ball fly away really fast. Hey, but don't take my word for it. Try it yourself. Now, a transfer of momentum. See? Not bad. See my head go back? That was a transfer of momentum. Oh. Oh. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Ping pong balls are great for ping pong, but they're not for bowling. <laughs> not enough momentum. Oh, a scientist. Bowling balls are about three kilograms. They're heavy enough, and we can get them moving fast enough so they have enough momentum to knock down all the pins at once. That is, uh, if we can hit it just right. Well, that was pretty good. But suppose we had a heavier ball, like four or five kilograms. Then it would have enough momentum to knock down every pin every time. Now, that would be cool. Hey, Bill. Huh? Catch! Oh. It's time for Mind Your Manners with Billy Kwan. Today's episode, Forces of Fury. Oh, nice streak. Yes. I'm really hitting these babies. I've got the big mole going here. Momentum. Yes. You know, momentum depends on how much things weigh and how fast they are moving. I don't care, not gonna make it. Oh, well, watch this. Uh, oh. Hey, you, Mr. Cubo Head! You just ruined the most perfect shot ever! No, we must fight! Well, alright, then let me limber up first. Ha! <laughs> 
Very nice momentum. You fool, the more something weighs, the more momentum it has. Ah. Remember, kids, be like Billy. Know your momentum. This little ball has weight, and when it's moving, it has momentum. Watch. So when we put this ball on the roller cart of science and give the cart a push, the cart and everything on it will have momentum in that direction. And it won't change the momentum in any other direction. Here we go. Isn't that cool? The ball went up and came down without changing the direction of its momentum. Hi, my name's Susan Young. I'm an engineer at Ford Motor Company, and I work with these guys to help make cars safer. Tests are run here and they, they simulate exactly what happens in a car crash. This is just regular tempera paint, poster paint, and we wet it down before the test and that way we can tell if his face hit anything in the car. And we expect it to hit the airbag and there's usually a pretty nice face print right on there if you use enough paint. Every time you get into your car and, and you're on the road and the car's moving, you and the car both have momentum. When the car stops, you will keep moving. And this is where your seatbelt really becomes important because the seatbelt will stop you from moving. After the test, we get together with the other engineers and watch the film and analyze the data and make decisions about how to make the cars safer. How about a game of momentum? The momentum of the mallet gets transferred to the ball. Now's my chance to transfer momentum from my ball to his ball. See, even with my foot on my ball, keeping my ball from going up and down, momentum was still able to transfer through it this way. I'm okay. I'm okay. Of course, the faster the mallet is moving, the more momentum you can transfer. When Dad's around, things get knocked down. Momentum has its day. But he's our dad. Like in this classic example, the pinball game of science. Not that bad, not that bad. When I pull back this plunger and let it go, the momentum is transferred from the plunger to the ball. Check this out. Thanks a lot, Bill. You're welcome. Try this. Thread a string through a straw. Okay. Then tie the string to a couple things in your house. Then put two long pieces of adhesive tape on the straw like this. Now, inflate a balloon. Any balloon will work, but these long, skinny ones are best. Tape the balloon to the straw. Now, the momentum of the air in the balloon going this way will equal the momentum of the tape straw balloon assembly going that way. You ready for some momentum? Three, three, two. Each other, momentum can transfer. Like this! When she hit the ground, her momentum transferred from her to the sand. That's why some sand scattered. Fly versus windshield. Part one, the RV. A fly has momentum. So does an RV. I'm devastated that you're getting married. I'm just devastated. I thought I was the one. Yeah, well, me. Huh. Oh. The RV's momentum wins. Don't even bother tuning in next week to Fly vs. Windshield. The faster you push me, the farther I get. You're adding velocity. The faster you push me, the farther I get. You're adding velocity. I will roll very far. 
our show. Thanks for watching. If you'll excuse me, I've got some mass and velocity to multiply. See ya! Watch the camera, Bill! Ah! Produced in association with the National Science Foundation. Okay. A model rocket is a rocket. So the moment... Oh, okay, sorry. A model rocket is a rocket. So it moves... Oh, boy. I got it now. Here we go. A model rocket is a rocket, so it uses momentum to move. The momentum of the hot fuel going this way equals the momentum of the rocket going that way. Yes! Okay, here we go. Ready? Action. The faster you go, the more momentum you have. Whoa! Faster! Faster! More! More! Momentum! Careful, huh? Whoa! Brought to you by Seatbelts, transferring your momentum since 1965. Whenever something's moving, it has momentum. And the lab door is big and heavy, so to open it, we need momentum. Ah. Let's get some momentum. Right. Bill, watch out, Bill! 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 Bill. Bill. See, moving things have momentum. Now, the faster something's going, the more it weighs, the more mass it has, well, the more momentum it has. Now, when moving things run into each other, momentum can transfer. Take a look at this. It's our momentum bowling ball machine of science. Now, a bowling ball is heavy, right? If it's moving, it's going to have momentum. Watch what happens when I give it a push. Careful. Objects that have momentum run into each other, some of that momentum transfers. And the faster something's going, and the more it weighs, the more mass it has, the more momentum will transfer. You can transfer momentum from one thing to another. All you need is a ruler, a dime, and a quarter. Now what you want to do is line up the dime really close to one end of the ruler. And then watch. The quarter's momentum is transferred to the ruler and then to the dime, which moves away really quick. Now try the same experiment in the opposite direction, only this time it's the dime that moves the quarter. Now put the quarter really close to the end of the ruler, and see the quarter only moves a little bit, because the quarter weighs more than the dime. Hey, it's science. And now, great moments in momentum. and it's going down the road. It's got momentum. It hits a holiday ornament that happens to be hanging in the middle of the road. See, the ornament bounces off the truck. The truck transfers some of its momentum to the ornament. Now, suppose the ornament couldn't move. Suppose somebody uh, built a brick wall in the middle of the road. Now, we'll make the truck run into the ornament again. And when it does, it's going to transfer momentum. added up all the momentum of all the pieces of the ornament and all the marbles, they would equal the same amount of momentum as when the ornament just bounced off the truck. 
Isn't that wild? Isn't that wild? I mean, you drug full of If you're not moving, then you don't have any momentum. But moving things do have momentum. Momentum is movement. A model rocket is a rocket, and it uses momentum to move. The momentum of the hot fuel going this way equals the momentum of the rocket going that way. equals the momentum of the rocket going that way. Halle is a sport that originated in Spain. And it's the fastest game. You get in the tip and you flick your wrist and it pops out. The momentum in here just builds up until it flies off the tip and that's how it gets its high speeds. It's um, been clocked around 300 kilometers an hour. And it's basically the world's fastest game. You know, dear, I wonder why our window keeps... Faster! More! And more! Momentum! Careful, huh? Build by the science guy. Inertia is a property of matter. Brought to you by Seatbelts, transferring your momentum since 1965. Whenever something's moving, it has momentum. And the lab door is big and heavy, so to open it, we need momentum. Huh. Let's get some momentum. Right, Bill, watch out. Bill. 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 See, moving things have momentum. Now, the faster something's going, the more it weighs, the more mass it has, well, the more momentum it has. Now, when moving things run into each other, momentum can transfer. Take a look at this. It's our momentum bowling ball machine of science. Now, a bowling ball is heavy, right? If it's moving, it's going to have momentum. Watch what happens when I give it a push. Careful. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> See, when objects that have momentum run into each other, you know, some of that momentum transfers. Now, the faster something's going and the more it weighs, the more mass it has, the more momentum will transfer. <laughs> you can transfer momentum from one thing to another. All you need is a ruler, a dime, and a quarter. Now what you want to do is line up the dime really close to one end of the ruler. And then watch. The quarter's momentum is transferred to the ruler and then to the dime, which moves away really quick. Now try the same experiment in the opposite direction. Only this time, it's the dime that moves the quarter. Now put the quarter really close to the end of the ruler, and see the quarter only moves a little bit, because the quarter weighs more than the dime. Hey, it's science. And now, great moments in momentum. and it's going down the road. It's got momentum. It hits a holiday ornament that happens to be hanging in the middle of the road. See, the ornament bounces off the truck. The truck transfers some of its momentum to the ornament. Now, suppose the ornament couldn't move. Suppose somebody uh, built a brick wall in the middle of the road. Now, we'll make the truck run into the ornament again. And when it does, it's going to transfer momentum. If you added up all the momentum of all the pieces of the ornament and all the marbles, they would equal the same amount of momentum as when the ornament just bounced off the truck. 
Isn't that wild? Isn't that wild? I mean, you can truck full of If you're not moving, then you don't have any momentum. But moving things do have momentum. Momentum is movement. A model rocket is a rocket, and it uses momentum to move. The momentum of the hot fuel going this way equals the momentum of the rocket going that way. The momentum of the hot fuel going this way equals the momentum of the rocket going that way. Ballet is a sport that originated in Spain. And it's the fastest game. You get it in the tip and you flick your wrist and it pops out. The momentum in here just builds up until it flies off the tip and that's how it gets its high speeds. It's um, been clocked around 300 kilometers an hour. And it's basically the world's fastest game. You know, dear, I wonder why our window keeps breaking. It's momentum, Dad. <laughs> when this ball hits the ground, its momentum will go right back into the ball. It'll bounce. Now we'll drop the same type of ball. Only this one has been soaked in very cold liquid nitrogen. It's very cold and the ball's thin rubber skin will be brittle. And uh, maybe a little flat. Hmm. Now the momentum of the individual pieces is equal to the momentum of the bouncing ball. The explosion doesn't make any difference. That's what we call the conservation of momentum. And now, more great moments in momentum. This has been more great moments in momentum. The Soapbox Derby is a car without any motors or anything, just gravity, momentum, and aerodynamics also has a big part to do with it. How does this come down? Just like that? Just straight down. Come on, can I check my brake now? There you go, David. You go down the hill and it goes really fast. You don't have an engine and you break when you get past the white line. When you get to the bottom of the hill, the cars have a lot of momentum. The more momentum, the better. How can rockets zoom through space no where there's nothing to push against? Well, consider the following. Rockets move.